Hi guys, welcome back to Tactics Ogre and I've loaded us all the cutscenes. Let's head on into Scabellum. But he's out. So quiet. It doesn't seem like a port city. Since the White Fang troops arrived, the people in the towns around here have been more cautious. This port used to be bustling with activity. Who's there? How rude to ask questions without first introducing yourself. The woman in the middle looks like a knight of rent or ranunculus. They've already filtered into this town. We may have no choice but to fight them. She's from ranunculus? I guess from her attire that she's a spellcaster. David, be mindful of the elements. You know about the four natural forces that protect us, right? Of course I know. Let's go. How annoying! If you get in our way, we'll kill you. See you guys after the battle. They're too much for us! We've got to do something! David! I'm glad that you're safe! And you as well! We'll celebrate our reunion after we deal with these rogues. I guess this is it for me. After we were attacked, we boarded a small craft and came to this port where we spoke to the mayor. The townspeople have been willing to provide information, but not money or soldiers. Are they too cowardly to protect themselves? They take our protection for granted. Since the island was subjugated by the Holy Lotus Empire, Ovis has fallen under the jurisdiction of Felis. I've heard that some towns still have a grudge against Lotus because of the Reformation. Things probably won't go very smoothly, even though this is Lotus' territory. But it's also true that Southerners want nothing to do with Ranunculus. They dislike both us and the people of the North. As for the task at hand, our mission is to investigate and resolve the conflict here. According to our information, the number of foreign soldiers and pirates has increased over the last year or two. We also heard that pirates were spotted here a few days ago, so we hid and waited for their return. Then you showed up. The White Fang troops are under the direct order of the Lord of Ranunculus. He must have some hand in the current problems. The patrols. They've ruled Ranunculus for generations. The current Lord is Nerus. Before inheriting that title, he was the head knight of the White Fang troops. I doubt this is merely a show of power. So have you discovered their intentions? No. I'm not certain of anything yet. They've been acting in small groups. Their leader's a knight. But the rest seem to be disorderly fellows, maybe bandits. Oddly enough, they've made no demands. They've just been excavating ruins and collecting old books. Well, I doubt they're here merely as historians. What do you estimate their numbers to be? We know little about their strength or, to ob or true objective, but we do know that the troops which are causing the recent problems are stationed by the ruins southeast of Naja. Their leader if ne is Nichart Verfault, a knight of Ranunculus. Will you attack them head-on? No. If we attack them directly, the enemy will have the advantage, because they're more fam familiar with this area. Therefore, my plan is to attack them from the flanks. That way, we'll have their backs to the ocean. I'll go through the forest, and you cross Vespa Hill and attack from the west. But, we're too few to divide in half. Take this. Prepare your troops using these campaign funds. Enter the ruins while we lure their main force out. Capture the leader and find out their purpose. Alright. 